right, so let's talk about legendary director Sam Raimi's comments that he made recently at WonderCon regarding Spider-Man 4 as well as Avengers Secret Wars. Now, these are two projects that he's been rumored to be linked to for quite some time now. Almost right after No Way Home when people saw Tobey Maguire in the movie, rumors started to circulate of a potential rebooting of Spider-Man 4, the canceled movie that was supposed to come after the original Spider-Man 3. And we finally have some traction as to what is going on with that movie, which it's just a rumor. He's not actually doing Spider-Man 4 for right now and also the rumors of him taking over as the director of Avengers Secret Wars also is apparently just a rumor he actually has not gotten the call yet he would like to be a part of that movie but he confirmed that yeah he's not tied to either project so when he was asked directly about if he was going to be the director for Avengers Secret Wars here's what he had to say I love 90% of the Marvel heroes that I've read in the great Stan Lee Marvel Universe comic books I would love to work with Marvel again they haven't reasonably asked me to I hope they had a good experience with me they haven't asked me yet I hope they they do. Raimi has also expressed interest in directing Spider-Man 4 with Tobey Maguire, a movie that fans have made no secret about wanting to see happen even after all these years. So here are my thoughts on this. Now, when it comes to Sam Raimi, I mean, this man has undoubtedly made a massive impact on the horror genre in movies, and he really did a great job with Spider-Man 1 and 2. And I know that Spider-Man 3 has been respected as time has gone on, but let's be honest, when that movie came out, it was, it was a disappointment. And when it came to Doctor Strange, some things I liked, some things I didn't. So it's, it's very difficult. Now, if you asked me back in 2006, if I thought that Sam Raimi should be the one to direct Avengers, it would probably be an ecstatic yes. I mean, after all, Spider-Man 2 is is one of my favorite movies of all time, if not possibly my favorite superhero movie of all time. It's definitely my favorite Spider-Man movie. Now, when it comes to the recent Doctor Strange Multiverse of Madness, I mean, that movie definitely had a lot of issues, but it also had a lot of things that I enjoyed. And when it comes to Avengers Secret Wars, I just get a little bit nervous messing around because we are in a time where every movie counts quite a bit, in my opinion at least. I think that the general audience and consensus has become disillusioned with Marvel. I just feel that every movie moving forward needs to be great. And that's not to say that Sam Raimi isn't capable of making a great movie, but I just worry that you're still kind of taking a risk with him, especially seeing as his most recent movie, Doctor Strange, wasn't really well received. I totally understand if other people will give him that opportunity after all. Like I said, Spider-Man 2 is an incredible movie. It just is. Now, when it comes to Spider-Man 4, everyone on my channel knows this is my Spider-Man. This is the Spider-Man that I grew up with. I just wonder where they would go with Spider-Man 4. I just don't know if there is more story to tell, and I just worry about kind of rehashing something and potentially making it all worse. I'm not saying that Spider-Man 3 was a great way to end it, and I'm sure some of you feel that it couldn't get worse than that, so what do they have to lose? But in my opinion, I kind of feel like they should maybe just let that go and kind of save Toby for like those big moments like they did with No Way Home. I just worry about ruining that legacy. Now, would I go see it if they made Spider-Man 4? Yeah, I definitely would, and I would be very hopeful it would be good. But I'm definitely not in the camp where I'm like, it has to be made, make it happen. I definitely would be just as happy with them just leaving the original trilogy alone. And it turns out that the rumors aren't actually true. He is not directing Avengers Secret Wars and he is not doing Spider-Man 4. So I guess we'll wait and see to find out who will be the director of that movie and if Spider-Man 4 will actually happen. I think right now they're just focusing on Tom Holland. There's been like a whole thing behind the scenes between Marvel and Sony involving that movie. For now, I think that's the priority and and I kind of feel like that is where they should put their full attention because like I said early in the video, it is important that these movies get attention, make good movies. And we can't just be leaning on the fact that it's Star Wars, it's a superhero that people love. If Sam Raimi gets the call, I mean, I'll be hopeful. He's not personally my first choice as much as I love the guy and I love what he's done. So anyways, that's my thoughts on Sam Raimi's statements. Let me know in the comments what you thought of his statements. Leave a like if you found this video entertaining or informative. Maybe consider subscribing if you enjoy the content on my channel. And as always, my name's Eric Rosas and I hope you all have a fantastic day.